In this video, we are continuing uh, with the uh, area of figures, and we're specifically, we're going to be talking about uh, areas of circles, and in a future video, we're going to be talking about areas of sectors. So let's uh, skip down to the formula, which uh, some of you may remember. So if you remember, the area of a circle is given by the formula A, and I'll usually put just a little circle symbol for the subscript, so area of a circle is equal to pi r squared. So a is the area and r is the radius. And uh, again, hopefully this is uh, something that you remember or and that you've learned before. So if we skip down here and uh, let's take a look at example c just to do uh, one example that kind of brings in a couple different concepts. So we've got this square that's 25 feet by 25 feet. And we want to find this shaded area. So if you analyze this, you'll notice that really this is the area of the square, and then we're going to cut out the circle. So we're going to need two different formulas. We're going to need the area of a square, which we know is s squared, and we're going to need the area of a circle, which is pi r squared. So then the shaded area is going to be s squared for the area of the square minus pi r squared for the area of the circle. So the only thing that we need to do here is find the radius of the circle. So we can see that the radius goes from the center of the circle, which is also the center of the square, to the circle and square. So it's going to have to be half of the side of the square. So since the side of the square is 25, this radius is going to be 12.5. So now we have all the information we need. This is going to be 25 squared minus pi times 12.5 squared. And that should be... 529 minus 415.5, or the shaded area turns out to be 113.5 inches squared. All right, so uh, again, make sure you get all your questions uh, answered, and we'll see you in the next video.